Hi there, my name is Brose O'Donovan. I'm the Disability Officer for LIT for all campuses. I work in the Access Service with a team of um, an additional four team members, two learning disability learning advisors and two educational support workers. If you are a student who experiences a specific learning difficulty such as dyslexia or dyspraxia, um, or if you experience a physical disability, a sensory disability, or a long-term medical condition, we'd be very happy to meet with you and chat about how we can support you during your time here. We currently have nearly 600 students registered across all of our campuses. Um, some students require very minimal support, so for example, they might need nothing more than a spelling and grammar waiver or some extra time for their timed exams, whereas other students might need more ongoing daily support such as a sign language interpreter or a personal assistant or note taker. Some students might require a travel grant to and from LIT if they don't have access to public transport due to the impact of their disability. Some students mightn't be 100% certain if there is anything that we can offer you, if you would qualify for anything, so if that's your situation, we'd invite you to come along to meet with us, have a chat with myself or one of my colleagues, and we'll just determine if there's anything we could support you with. Some of you might have applied through the DARE scheme, the Disability Access Route to Education. If that is the case, um, we'd be very happy to meet with you. We would have received a copy of your documentation that you would have provided to DARE. So if that's the case, uh, we'll get in contact with you as soon as possible. If you don't hear from us straight away, keeping in mind we do have a high volume of students who are reporting into our services at the start of the academic year. So if you need help urgently, please get in contact with us. You don't have to wait for us to ring you. Um, contact us at any time and we'll arrange an appointment for you. If you didn't come through DARE, you didn't apply to DARE, um, at, or you you weren't deemed eligible by the CAO for DARE, you can still avail of supports with us. We'd be very happy to meet you and just chat over how we might um, put something in place to support you. The only thing we'd ask is that if you did not in fact apply through DARE, that you would provide us with a small bit of documentation to verify your needs. So please keep in mind that any supports we put in place for you are strictly um, at your discretion, as in we could change supports if they're not appropriate for you. We can increase support. Sometimes students find that over their time in LIT is they get more used to things here that they would need less support. So it's very fluid. We will respond to whatever requests you have and do our best for you. So thank you very much for your time today. Wish you the very best with your studies and please do get in touch with us anytime if you think we can help you with anything. Thank you.